Well, Arsenal have won all five of the previous Barclays Women's Super League meetings with Leicester City by an aggregate score of 20 of experience, both domestically and internationally. Here is Momiki, who can turn one into the penalty area only to see it turned away. Leicester have won their first corner of the game, though, eight minutes in. Yuko Momiki arriving in January. And, uh, well, she's impressed so far in her time in the Barclays Women's Super League. Catley finds the pass wide. Arsenal might be in here. Having been in trouble at the other ends, they work it to Mead. Edge of the area, big deflection on that though, and it takes it over the top and away for a corner. Well, she has been feeling as though she, after that long injury and that spell away, is finding her best. And she started sharply. Williamson from range with an ambitious hit. Has been an emotional return for her, for both club and country. Season they are way above bottom of the table. Bristol City currently have an 11 point gap between them. Well, that was a fierce drive. Mamiki unleashing and Zinsberger gives the fans here at the Emirates something to cheer about. Wonderful stop, pushing away. Arsenal free kick taken by McCabe. And it's an easy gather in the end for Lisa Kopp. Came in right down the middle. There was plenty of power behind it. Either side could have been trouble. Axtenius. Here is Little. No real tempo about this Arsenal attack. Mead looking to change that here. Quick pass. Nicely done by Arsenal, and Mead is in, and there's the opening goal of the game. And the goal that the Arsenal fans came to see here at the Emirates. It was measured, almost rehearsed. Lovely passing and moving from the Arsenal front line. And Beth Mee continues her brilliant run of form. Linking up ever so well with Caitlin Ford here and lifting over Lisa Kopp and into the back of the Leicester net to make it Arsenal 1 Leicester 0. Run. Pelover goes the other way though. And here is Russo in that playmaker role. McCabe into a crossing position, lifts one through. Big deflection on that, but the deflection takes it away for another Arsenal corner. Lovely bursting run from Katie McCabe. Came racing into the penalty area with real purpose here. Making this underlapping run that the outperformers this season in the Barclays Women's Super League. Well, she's looking to connect with a teammate and she's found Mamiki here. And now Rose, who can control, and Tierney! Brings out the best from Manuela Zinsberger. It's a big palm in the end from Arsenal's goalkeeper, who is able to prevent the effort from Tierney going any further towards the goal line. Lovely chip, certainly Arsenal. Here is Russo. Uh, Pellover sensibly, not wanting to give Leicester the chance to break before half time. Manages the ball and works it back towards the halfway line. While her goal separates the two teams in a first half of... Conf Leicester haven't won in the last four games. Hasn't been too much of a hangover from the defeat in the FA Cup semi-final. They return to the international fray. Williamson slips the pass. Fox with so much room here, delivers in, a nice looking cross too. Came in low, ricocheted up into the air. And Arsenal couldn't get there, they will look for a penalty this time. 
pretty quick reaction from the referee who was uh, there to wave play on. And this was the challenge on Caitlin Ford. Not enough to constitute. Chance to break here for Ford, who does ever so well and tries to catch out Lisa Kopp with the early effort on goal. It was one that was well watched by the Dutch international who makes the save. Today, seen her play in this playmaker role, but uh, she's almost been playing as a central midfielder today. Arsenal breaking, making their move, looking for another. Tierney sweeping away, and then the volley flashed over the top of the bar by Katie McCabe. Sat up nicely for the opportunity on goal. The effort was dipping, but it was dipping a bit too late to cause any problems here for Leicester's goalkeeper, Lisa Kopp. their best to bring this ball closer to goal and Lisa Kopp came didn't get there and then the effort over the top of the bar from Alessia Russo never really looked set as she was trying to volley it goalwards and it goes over the top of the bar Had to take it quickly, there was pressure. Go for that second goal, hasn't really presented itself. Here's Pellover. And Arsenal are breaking and Arsenal are in. It's a big chance as well for Caitlin Ford. And in the end, she drives it straight at Lisa Kopp. Swift build up. And Ford arriving with a big chance. Superb defending to prevent them from doing that. And away they go here, Arsenal working it nicely on towards Blackstenius. Here is the chance for Fox. Well, she was forced wide. And the angle was always a difficult one to cause too much in the way of trouble. And the effort in the end is rather a tame one. And it's a comfortable stop for Kopp. Tack it. Fox again, forward on the right. And looking to cause some problems here for the Leicester defence and very nearly does exactly that with an angle drive that was fired up towards the top corner and well saved in the end by Lisa Kopp. Brilliant effort on goal and a wonderful save. Because here comes the change. A relatively quiet afternoon by her standards for Stina Blackstenius. Anything but quiet, though. Staker for Arsenal. Still have a chance at the top of the Barclays Women's Super League. Well, it's cut back for the opportunity to go for goal for Pellover. Her 50th Arsenal appearance today. And this time the effort closed down. And they have struggled here to break Leicester down in their attempt to find the second goal. Brilliant run here by Catley. Determination to find Russo! There is a second goal for Arsenal. Fired in with delight by Alessia Russo. While she spent most of the game playing as a deep line playmaker, with Blackstenius off of the field, she switched to a more familiar number nine role. And she strikes the blow here that gives Arsenal breathing room in this tie. Arsenal two, Leicester City nil. And it's Alessia Russo on the score sheet. Brilliant football from Arsenal. The angle is there for another attack. This time Russo is denied. Arsenal won't be though. There is goal number three. And a second of the afternoon for Beth Mead.
devastating stuff from Arsenal, ramping things up at the end of this game. They've been made to wait by an organised Leicester City side, but they just couldn't keep them out here. Rousseau with a big chance, but then she did enough to feed it back into the six-yard box. And who was there waiting? Her England teammate, Beth Mead, with a lovely chip. Leicester's corner is comfortably dealt with by Arsenal, who will be eager to keep the clean sheet. Sinsberger doesn't get there, though, as the ball is delivered in. And she'll be pretty happy to see that one sail over the top of the bar. Did ever so well in the first half, Sinsberger. Made a couple of really good stops. Didn't get there this time, though. Really attractive football from Arsenal. Uh, what a chance it was to score in the middle. Pelova may still have that opportunity. Well, it's delivered to the back of the area. They were queuing up. And Leonard Mornham is the one who gets the final touch. She can't quite turn it goalwards, though. Well, the challenge by Catley on Tierney was a rough one. The chance on goal was a good one. And so was the save from Zinsberger, who gets down to push away. No. Arsenal's excellent end of season form continues. Best Mead with two in a measured Arsenal performance. He should be.